Welcome to EVE Online, this is Major Freak, and this is going to be about the different outputs you can get while mining. Um, this is not completely thorough, this is going to be uh, the Orca test. Um, I'll make another one with a porpoise. Do note that these are high sec fits um, with a couple of low sec fits I believe. Um, do I have any... No, I think this is the, these are the high sec fits. Okay, so, um, what we're going to do is we're going to, um, have a, um, a crystal tech two crystal and a tech one crystal, uh, all new on each client, uh, just to test if, um, um, I heard rumors that it takes longer for the Tech 1 crystals to burn out, and Tech 2 crystals are really expensive. Um, and they actually, the, the volume of them is uh, a lot more. Um, Spotty main. There's Tech 1. Uh, that's 6, and that's 10. So, you know, they're not usually more, but uh, yeah, it does add up. Um, when you got a whole bunch of them. Um, and of course, uh, lowers the chances of people who are interested in ganking you, but I, I, I'm not sure if they're going to gank you because of your cargo. Pretty sure they're just going to ship scan you. Alright, so we're going to start mining. Um, first off, of course, when you're talking about different mining ships, is the range. Um, I'll put my boosts on. Alright. Alright. So. Um, the modulated strip miner has the same range as the Tech 1 strip miner. A uh, range of 44. Uh, that is, of course, with some harvest uh, implants. I actually went on a singularity and tested out the. Lag. Um, I tested out the mid-grade uh, complete set and I, I think I had a really long range with my Hulk um, I think 51 or something don't quote me it was it was up really up there uh, really nice um, but yeah with a with a few harvest and uh, genolution uh, for power and uh, CPU um, always like those. You get a range of, and now all my guys have the same implants, um, well, all my miners, um, of, uh, 44. And this is the Mackinac, 35. And the Skiff, 35. See the same range. And 35 for the Retriever. So as you can see, the bonus is probably going to be for the Coveter, which I never use, um, and the Hulk of 44. The advantages of the Mackinac is the massive ore hold, the same with the uh, Retriever. The Skiff is got double what your, your Hulk has, um, but it's got way more tank. Now, the attraction of using a skiff is that nobody's going to try to gank you. Um, ever. Um, if they do, they're just wasting money, which is hilarious. Um, that, that they've always said, you know, Bring more tank. If you bring more tank, we just bring more DPS. Or, you know, if you bling it out, well, if you bling it out, they're gonna gank you for sure. I would. Um, but yeah, I mean, the idea that you make yourself an unattractive target, they'll just bring more DPS is total bullshit. Um, if they've you personally pissed them off, of course they're gonna go after you, hammers and tongs. But yeah, I mean, they are. It's the law of low flying fruit. You know. Um, yeah, it's like you know. It, if you're being chased by something, all you have to do is just be a little bit faster than the slowest 
um, person in your group and uh, yeah asshole bison that's my motto be an asshole bison um, so uh, let's talk about uh, uh, volume so with a boost I'll get 27.2 with my Hulk uh, with the tech 1 crystal I'll get 25.3 okay with a Mac it's gonna be 19.3 and the tech one crystal it's going to be 17.9 i think it's about 10 percent my audience good guesstimate uh 19.3 and 17.9 for the skiff and then for the retriever you've got 15.9 and 14.8 now i don't i hate math so what we're going to do is just be hands-on we're going to turn on all our lasers I'm going to stagger it because we have a Hulk in our midst. Oh. Bugger. So I need to just be a little bit closer to that one. Do, 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 do. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. I think. Yes. Okay. And. Not going to be completely staggered, but. characters that uh, had a really nice long range. It was quite amazing. Alright. Yeah, one of my characters uh, had uh, a little bit more. I had full set of implants uh, low grade and was able to uh, get out to 46, 48? I forget. It was, it was quite a ways. So I got spoiled for that. All right, so get you set up. Everybody happy? Okay, and I'll get my drones to start mining as well. So this guy's halfway full, a little bit full, a little bit full, a little bit full. So that's the thing about the Hulk, you just got it, it's just so much work. And of course I have the, uh, the high wall. Um, Amex 005, 1005, 5% uh, extra. There we go. Okay. Yeah, as you can see, it's pretty slow. So we got 305, 305, 279. And 506. So it's pretty much double um, what a retriever can do. 
Now all these crystals are new, so they shouldn't have any damage yet. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I, I believe it's chance based what I've known in my experience. It's definitely kind of like you roll the dice on RNG and, and you get a bit of a damage. Um, not sure what the minimum amount of damage. I think that's an RNG too. Um, but yeah, you can, as you can see, it's probably went from zero to three percent damaged. But yeah, I believe it's definitely RNG for that. So we'll all I'll be dragging the uh, the Hulk into the, the cargo bay. Uh, I mean the fleet hangar. Uh, just to see uh, the others slowly climb up. Now the skiff the Mac should be outputting at the same speed. There we go. The retriever slower. And of course the, the Hulk going like... Going like gangbusters. Yeah, obviously you'll need to drag the the skiff more than more than the Mac. Uh, would I recommend the skiff over this? Nineteen point three versus nineteen point three. I mean, you're doing the same amount. If the only attraction to the Mac is to have an obscene amount of time uh, that you can, you know, take a bio, um, do some dishes fold some clothes, vacuum, uh, you know, do do the household chores that you don't really get a chance to do if you're doing the doing the Hulk thing. Constantly. Uh, I think every seven minutes you gotta uh, do this and you've got four clients doing this. It's um yeah, seven minutes isn't a lot of time actually. Uh, yeah, it's pretty pushing and, and you hate that ding of the um, or hold filling up. There we go. Almost needing to drag. Yeah, as you can see, it the the Hulk for all the work you put in, um, not being a not not being able to watch a video, um, check another client, check your scouts, watch local, um, all that goes by the wayside uh, when you're doing the Hulk, and it's as you can see, it's it's not like you're getting a crazy amount more, you know, like twenty percent more when you're when you're using Hulk, you know, or thirty percent more. I don't know. I could I should I'll do the math with you guys of course. I hate math, but yeah, I'll, I'll totally show you what it's like. Um But yeah, it's uh it's interesting. That uh the amount of work you put in for the Hulk you don't really get that much more out of it. I mean, if you want to strip a belt, that's fine. And I've done it. And I, most of my previous, previous videos in high sec were on hulks. And sure, you put the you put the sweat in, you can clear a belt a little bit quicker. And you got a little bit more range, so you don't have to move around that much. That's the key, see? You got more range, you don't have to relocate a lot. Um, though I've found in a belt, you're, when you're using hulks, um, you've still got about six roids scattered about you that you need to relocate. Um, so it's, it's not, it's not optimal. It's not like you can cover the entire belt in less relocates, really, honestly. Uh, but the time spent, 
eh, I don't know. It's just not, it's just, if you could cover in the entire moon field uh, using four bookmarks only and get everything, I'd, to I'd totally be all over the Hulk. Oh yeah, absolutely. 100%, you know? But no, um, nope. You cannot. And so it's not that much worth it. I love the Mackinac. Just because I can upload a video, I can edit it, I can watch YouTube, I can I can do other things on the computer, I can um, I can watch local way more often, I can check up Intel a lot more. Um, so it's it's highly attractive uh, to what I do. You know, I mean, you know, besides being a wage slave for a Hulk. Yeah, so, um, about, yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, and as you can see, it's just nice and easy for the Mac and the Retriever. As you can see, the, the Retriever is about 20% less than the Mac. And this guy is, you know... 13, 13, 10, and of course, the, the Hulk is just, just outpacing them like crazy, and I'll finish the video, uh, when this sucker is full, and do the math for you guys, This is just random, by the way. It can't. I'll have to play for a while, and I'll clear the belts on these and let you know if, in fact, there is any difference between using Tech One crystals and Tech Two. Because it was a rumor I heard. So, yeah, see, I don't know about this. So yeah, I mean, when you hear rumors about Eve, it's 90% of the time it's either a troll. Uh, th sorry, 30% of the time it's a troll. 30% uh, of the time it's a uh, misunderstanding of the mechanic 30% uh, of the time it's uh, CCP misrepresenting what happens because nobody understands it on the CCP side and they just marketing put in a description of something and it confused people uh, so that's like 90% <laughs> you know 10% of the time it's true uh, but it always fact check fact checking in this game is so crucial yeah, because I doubted I would have used Tech One crystals for a while because it's only ten percent, and if you if you had to go through the rest of them, you're less expensive, yada yada. But really, I mean, it's worth it to go with Tech Two crystals. All right, and that's it. I'll uh, let you guys know about the math and the crystal death later. Thanks.